Welcome to GNU Tech Max. In this demo, I will show how to type basic mathematical formulas. A new formula can be inserted using the Insert Mathematics menu or one of the corresponding keyboard shortcuts. There are three basic types of formulas. Short, so-called inline formulas, appear right within surrounding text. Displayed equations span over entire line. Equation arrays are allowed to run over several lines. OK, so let us start a new formula. As you can see, the second toolbar changes when the cursor is inside the formula. Similarly, the insert menu is context dependent as well. There are various submenus for all kinds of mathematical symbols. When you hover over one of these symbols, the equivalent keyboard shortcut is shown in a help balloon. In fact, the keyboard shortcuts were designed according to a few systematic principles that allow you to obtain most mathematical symbols without exhausting your memory. The first such principle is the variant mechanism. TechMax uses the tab key for obtaining variants of various symbols. For instance, the Greek letters are obtained as variants of the Roman ones. The B also admits the flat sign as a variant and you can circulate among all possible variants using the tab key. You can also use shift tab to circulate in the opposite direction. The second principle is the possibility to combine various symbols into new ones. For instance, you can obtain an arrow by typing minus followed by superior. Typing superior twice, we obtain a double-headed arrow. Similarly, typing less followed by equal, we obtain the less than or equal symbol, which admits several variants. We can negate this symbol using the slash. Again, there are several variants. Using the add sign, you, you can put symbols inside circles or boxes. Characters in various mathematical fonts can be obtained using the function keys. For instance, F6 is used for bold symbols, F7 for calligraphic ones, F8 for fracture symbols, and certain combinations are also possible. Blackboard bold capitals are obtained by typing the same capital twice. In TechMax, formulas have more semantics than inside certain other systems such as LaTeX. For instance, multiplication and function application have to be explicitly entered using the star and spacebar. For instance, x times y plus f applied to x. When just typing several characters in a row, the result is considered to be an operator, like in sign here. In a similar way, mathematical constants such as e, pi and i are obtained as variants 
and display it using an upright font. Let us now show how to type a typical 2D formula. We start by inserting a fraction using the menus. We have already seen before how to insert subscripts and superscripts using the underscore and the hat. We may copy and paste. And again, using the menus, make a square root out of this. And now a full speed example. When typing an opening bracket, Techmax automatically inserts a pair of matching brackets. These brackets are also automatically resized. Inside small inline formulas, you may sometimes prefer fixed sized brackets. This can be achieved by clicking on the following icon. Using the META or Command modifier key in combination with the arrow keys, you may also manually resize the brackets. Sometimes one may need a closing bracket of a different type as the opening bracket. This is typically the case for intervals. When the cursor is before a closing bracket, then you may simply replace it by another one. When the cursor is behind the closing bracket, then you may also remove it altogether. In France, a different notation is used for intervals. The four types of intervals are then obtained through the variant mechanism. The type of an existing pair of brackets can actually be changed using the Structured Variant Mechanism by pressing Ctrl Tab. Let us next demonstrate the use of various other types of large symbols. Big operators are entered using Shift F5. White accents are entered using the ALT modifier key or ESCAPE ESCAPE. Extensible arrows are entered as follows. Let us finish our demo with some matrices. New rows and columns can be inserted using these icons or the corresponding keyboard shortcuts. One may copy entire rows, paste them,
one may even copy submatrices. We're now going to replace the A, all A's by B's. We may also use structured variance again, control tab, to turn our matrix into a determinant. Again, replace A's by B's. Put some nice zeros here. And one nice feature of Techmax is that we can associate some background colors. So that's all folks, thank you for your attention.